This is not how you guys sit on a couch, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> for you. We have, um, we go ahead and Brian loves his stuff, absolutely loves his stuff, so. Oh, geez. He's going to enjoy, um, it's a salad, like a clam salad. Um, he can cut the carbs here. And then we have Mi Wang. I haven't had this in a moment, a long, long moment. You must so, have with yes. Um, bon appetit. Looking the loader good. So track yes, your loader yes, back yes. off. Mine, mine, mine. So we are waiting for the car to cool down because we're heading out to pick up a dump truck um, for our projects in the future. Um, we don't want to put baby in the car right now because I know for sure it's freaking hot. It's like a hundred and something. Like, like the heat is just beaming. Right, Brian? Mm -hmm. Woo! So, um, heading out and excited to get this dump truck. Scuba has his own dump truck too, and I feel like we're copying him. This is a dump trailer. He has a dump truck. Yes. We gotta upgrade. Yes. He has a little tiny one, I'll show you later, that he plays with all the time, and I realized that, hey man, we're getting one too, ourselves. Everyone's gotta have one, right? Uh, yeah, all right, Scoops, we're ready to go. Can you Let's get go. His, uh, we are no. here. There it is, Coolio. Scooper is chill. I fed him on the way. And um, I think he wants to be out. He wants to be out, huh? Haka. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, we got the uh, dump trailer latched on and almost ready to go. Baby was fussy, so we took him out and just let him get a breather for a moment. It's too hot to go outside. Way too hot. So, we're staying in here. Yes. Yes. Wow. Here it is. Our uh, dump trailer. Lots of trash to dump, guys. Lots. Alright, so baby went to sleep and now me and Vin are going to run through this area to seal it up because we have to get this project moving. I mean, we started doing quarantine around March-ish. Now it's like freaking, I don't know, July? The end of July. Anyways, um, so run through this place to see what we need to do. What, what is important? I'm trying to tell my brother. Is we gotta get this off. This has to go off because flooring has to go in here, right? Mm -hmm. So this has to go off. You guys figure out this. I'm thinking you gotta move it over there, but I feel like it might be too big for that room, so we'll see where it should be going. I mean, it'd be great to just put it over this side, but I don't know, I haven't figured it out. But we gotta take it off. Um, then we're moving down this way. Gotta take this all the way up, right here. This goes all the way to the roof, to the top. So now it's the one room, the hallway. This is a hallway. So all that needs to take out right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this, just to open it up, okay? This is the laundry room. We gotta take this out, because it has to be flooring, right? And then um, open up this side of the wall to see how much I can break through. Okay. Mm -hmm. Come on, this way. Not dark, but... Gotta break out this wall all the way to this side. Okay? This has to go all the way up as well. The door all the way up. So now it's no longer a door, it's just an open space. Okay. How about all that? Hmm? All that we got paint. No, all this right here on this side. This side you keep, right? This side we keep because uh, I'm trying to see if... As You're gonna open that side up first. Yeah, I wanna see if I can, what, how much I can break off. And if I can break off a good amount, then I'll break off this side. Okay. But once that's all done, we seal this off, we do flooring, we get this place into living condition. Okay? <laughs> living condition, because this is too much now. We're living in a dumpyard, literally. <laughs> okay? So we got that, um, Dump truck outside. See? Doors still open, we have to close it down. Anyways, follow this way, follow this way. So 
as we are getting all this out, put the floorings in, go through this way. I feel like the herring bone, cause this should be the border, right? We should start from here to there. Yeah. Just in this area. Just in this area. It's fine. Now we might we might even extend it to that area, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Or do you want to just keep it here so it's like special? Well, we just run it and then we'll see how you look yeah. at, think about Definitely it. Definitely border here, border, border, and then you got the hair going on right here, right? All the way here. And then it would probably stop right here. So stop right here and the water should run all the way up. Oh, right? Okay. Right? Okay. That's where the water should end. You gonna show the new flooring you got? Yeah. So we got some new flooring today and I think I like it. I Bingo. Like it. I bought a box and Brian said, I don't want you to buy 150 boxes, I want you to buy one box and make sure that you're okay with it. So I'm happy with it because it's the color that I want. I want to be fresh, um, you know, kind of feel in this house. A lot of stuff in here has been really dark and gloomy, so I like that it's fresh and white and it just feels so like bright, okay? Um, this one is the same size as this. But this one is thicker in terms of like um, the quality is uh, basically much you know, thinner. Thicker than this one. This one's thinner. So this one's eight millimeters and this one's six point five millimeters. The guy at the store said it was just as great. Um, my homegirl Linda, she got cheap price. This is two fifteen for this luxury vinyl plank, which is really cheap because. These usually run for like three to seven dollars a square foot, okay? So she gave it to me for two fifteen. She upped the price to two twenty five because um, you know shipping China now is like expensive, so it has to up the price. Anyways, um, this one is thinner, but it's two twenty. Um, and also, it has the, it's the right color, so I had to make the decision with going with a thinner piece versus a thicker one, which is more protection for the house. But the guy said, this is just as fine. If you just want to be extra, extra, and then you get the thicker one, it's just she didn't have a color. So I really like this color. I think this is the one. Um, hopefully it's the one. If we put it in and I'm like, I don't like it, then I'm just gonna, Brian's just gonna kill me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> He's just gonna be like, man, I, I told you, I told you to double check. I told you, I was like, okay, I, you know? Anyways, um, I think this is it. Um, bingo. That's bingo. what she said the first time she saw yeah. it. I said bingo. Yeah. But I think it's gonna, it's gonna really open up this place, brighten it up, and make it feel more, you know, inviting and just feel good mood because this house was just kind of like a bad mood all the time. So I want that to be my All expression. over the place. Yeah. And um, maybe paint the uh, mantle black and this door black. I think it'll look really hot up against that white flooring. Brian calls my design the Shamu design, killer <laughs> whale design, whatever. Move along this way, move along this way. So. These are just notes, can I tell them? I would like to break down these two columns and have a beam go all the way across. If not, then we break down just that thinner one. I have a glass wall here, it'll look hot. And then we'll break down that centerpiece to connect to the outdoors. That'll come much later, but for sure now, um, before we put the flooring down, I really want to get these off the drywall. So the drywall comes off, um, let's see, on all three of them. We gotta cut them out and look nice because if we replace it, then we replace it with something nice and not just chop it off. So I'm cutting out this right here, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. 
and I'm cutting all this out or no? Not yet. Okay. Because um, we have to build out there first and then seal this off. Get yeah. It? We can't just cut it and then have flies coming in all day. So this room, what we need to do is, like I said earlier, cut this off. Just the drywall so we see what we can break and what we can't. So up here, here, here. Leave this one column right here because we mm -hmm. need that. These three and this and up there. Just, just open off. it up. Just open yeah, it up, right? Open it up, clean it up. And once it's all cleaned up, we really, oh, if you can just clean this up for me too as well, that'd be great. What do you mean, patch it up? Yeah. Well, yeah, you gotta patch this part up. You want me to patch this all the way up then? No, just the what we messed up here, but um... You're gonna open this place up, aren't you? are just opening where the... Yeah. Where that. But these right here from here on needs to be patched up from there on needs to be patched. Okay? It's just how it is. We messed up. But whatever, at least we know that it's an important wall. And um, once we got all that clean, we seal this two areas off. And open really it up. Well with plastic and then from there on we have all the flooring that we put get it yeah. and then when we when we come back to this during winter time then it'll be it'll be ready, ready to go yes. yeah get it because then we're not going to throw out you know but at least we just seal from here and here and it'll close off this area only in the house get yeah. it? and then moving on this way flooring goes here flooring goes in here flooring goes in the closet flooring goes in here Restroom. Busted out my uh, blue downstairs, and we gotta bust this out. The restroom. All that it's gotta be busted out. What you mean? The whole thing? Mm -hmm. The whole thing. Yes. The shower, everything. Just the flooring. Okay. The shower door needs to be removed. I don't know if. Uh, you need help with Tony doing that or whatever. Uh -huh. But the shower needs to be removed because we're doing the flooring and then if we put the shower door in, then we have to make sure that it's the right measurement. Mm -hmm. Get it? Mm -hmm. So that's the deal. Good. Yeah. Should be good, right? I mean, the guy who installed the shower, I was not like, yeah, well, he didn't even install it, right? And look, it's supposed to put it up to here. He put it on the other side. I'm like annoyed. Well, because you had to have some some type of more, and the, the, the fan. Well, the fan's okay, but yeah, well, come on. Yeah, he could have done better, but instruction. Anyways, um, yeah, I feel like up there it's gonna look crazy. You see it? It was just me. Gotta clean that up. I don't know what that is. What do you think that is? It does. It does. Yeah. Well, this looks like it's coming out too. All right. And then we, uh, we should be good to uh, rock and roll with our other projects. <laughs> Alright, um, so that's the site walk we've been. Once we finish all the flooring down here, but before we do the flooring, we gotta paint. Ooh. So I might paint the stairs. Let's see. Vince says I should since it's all bare. But. I don't know, it's a lot of work. But look. Nice grande. Stuff like this. It's shipping off. I gotta repaint it somehow. Right here. So stuff like that. And the worst part of painting, especially spray painting, is you gotta prep. That means everything needs to be sealed off properly so it does not get anywhere. No it's AC horrible. running. No AC running at that time. No AC for a while. Or well, for that day. Mm -hmm. And it's haunted the grays for sure. Have a dice. And then once this is done, then we move upstairs. Change the flooring. Alright, guys. That's the sight walk. Let's hope to get the job done. <laughs>